Now let us see that scenario with TC01, right? What happens when you try to assign two conflicting transaction codes uh, in SC01? So in order to do that, let's create two roles, AP01, right? Uh, let's say test role for business function. AP01. Now keep in mind, okay, you, your rule sets, okay, in ARA, uh, access risk analysis needs to be well defined, okay. So keep that in mind. So let's go and add a transaction code for AP01. So let's add F-44 here. Let's take only one transaction code, okay, and see what happens. So we'll generate the role now. Okay, this message shows up because of that user exits in plugin system that we maintained. Okay, so you are able to generate, okay, let's generate the role. Okay, so we are able to generate the role. So let's create the second role, okay. Um, F dash, no, F I zero four. Okay, let's say test role for business function. F I zero four. Save. Okay. Now here, let's add the transaction as an example, FCHI. Okay. Save authorizations and maintain the authorizations here. Generate the role. All right, so what did we do here so far? We created two role, X colon FI04 and X colon AP01, right? AP01, all right. Now let's go to SU01 and let's say create a user ID. Let's say, uh, say risk term, okay? Create a user ID. Let's say one, okay? This is not going to use in the roles anyway, so let's randomly generate the password. And you don't really need to maintain this. Let's do this, see what happens here. So we said X colon AP01, and we said X colon F I04. Now let us try to save this and see if what happens, okay? Oh, it was created. And let's see the roles. Why is it yes, right? Let's check the parameters. We said enable risk terminator with SU01 role assignment. We said yes. So, we are in HP1, HP, so there seems to be some problem with uh, SC01 assignment, maybe there is a bug in the system, otherwise what should happen is when you try to save the roles that have uh, conflicting transaction codes in them, uh, you should get an error message uh, message according to what you got during role creation, that there are violations. So you should get something similar in, um, in, in SU01 also at the bottom. So 
maybe there is a bug in the system and it's not working in this in this uh, system all right so if this is not working in se01 which means it will not work in se10 also so anyways so to risk terminator you need to have you set up this term you know these parameters from 1080 to 1088 right and in the grc system and then in the plugin systems you set it from 1000, 1001, 1002, and then from 1080, 1 to 1088. Okay. Um, let's see. Something is not right here. Okay. All right. So that's what it is. Okay. This is how uh, risk terminators work. 